Alright, well here's an update video since I put the Selenopsis Invecta in their soil um, nest now. Um, that's my outworld right there. A couple pieces of hot dog. They actually like it. I mean, they'll eat it. Uh, they, Selenopsis will eat anything. Uh, connecting tube going down here. Um, I've got the top half actually turned around and uh, set with cotton and a tubing so they get air through the top. And as you can see, they've been quite busy building the top part of their nest. You can see they're going back and forth in there. Sorry the light's not the best there. Um, one thing I did notice over here, see if I can get this light on here, give you a little bit of light. During the day, during the warm period, they like to bring their eggs outside the nest right here to incubate for the heat. Um, this pile of stuff, I have no clue what it is. It's not trash. Because the trash pile is over here in this corner of the outworld. As you can see, that's all dead ants and so forth over there. Um, and so, the, I don't know what that is. Kind of weird. Um, but they've been busy cutting their own little grooves and things and so forth. As you can see the inlet right there and there's some of them milling around. Been busy building their tunnels. They started a tunnel over here in the corner that actually goes down the back side. I'm not going to disturb them right now, especially with their eggs out right now. But as you can see, they have actually started building their own little tunnels throughout here. There's the main shaft. In fact, let's see if we can get down here and look. It's kind of hard to see inside there, but there's actually tunnel ma matrix inside there. It goes down. Um, they did get curious on the other side and go all the way down to the sand pile. In fact, that dig out right there is them when they hit the bottom. Which is not a big deal. Their main part of the tubing, I mean, uh, tunneling's in the upper part. Uh, of course, this tube right here is for watering it. Keeps the lower half here wet, and then the sand wicks it up into the sand into the soil. Um, there's the old hybrid nest that they came out of. Um, oh, and yeah, I am definitely ready for the queens. No doubt about it. All right. Well, that's just a little update on. Uh, the soil nest and everything. Um, when they get a little more building going on, I'll update it again.